I've worked with executives in the past who have questioned me. They've said, why do I have to practice my breathing if I've been practicing breathing all my life? Well, that's true. They are breathing every single day and, and so are you. However, there's a difference between the breathing you do every day and the breathing that you do when you want to feel more aligned and you wanna be that influential communicator. And here's why. When you're breathing correctly, your voice sounds much richer. It's fuller. You're not taking a lot of short breaths as you speak. There's a difference in tone, in pitch, and cadence. When you're breathing from your diaphragm, that's the sound that you want to achieve in your voice. When you're breathing from your throat or your chest, your voice sounds more shallow. Sometimes you don't have enough air in your voice box to be able to finish your sentence or a group of phrases and your voice begins to fade. Sometimes if there's not enough air and your vocal cords are banging together, your voice sounds harsh and coarse and it's not pleasing to the ear. So how do you know if you're breathing correctly? Well, that's the first exercise. It's simple. You're going to breathe for one minute in through your nose and out through your mouth. Seven count in, seven count out. And as you do, put your hand on your chest and on your stomach. And when you're done, take note, which hand was moving? If the hand on your stomach was moving, if it was expanding when you were breathing in and contracting with your stomach as you were breathing out, then you're breathing correctly. If the hand on your chest was moving, you're breathing incorrectly. The next two exercises are quick, easy, and they're recorded. For the first one, it's almost as if you're standing at an event and someone comes up to you and says, hi, my name is Deirdre. Who are you and what do you do? Without breathing deeply, just share your answer from the air that's already existing in your chest in two sentences, three sentences at the most. Record that and listen back to the sound, the pitch, and the cadence in your voice. Now, the second exercise is a little different, and you're going to record this one too. It's the same scenario. Somebody asks you, they tap you and say, who are you and what do you do? But this time, you're going to breathe in and out, some deep breathing a few times, and then speak your answer. Breathe out your answer. And if you're breathing correctly, the air will be from your diaphragm. So you'll be speaking out from your diaphragm. And when you listen back, you should hear the difference in your voice, in the pitch, the sound, and the cadence. Try this. Let me know how it goes. These exercises help you to feel more aligned, and to get your voice so that you can be the influential communicator.